Yo guys, what is going on? We are back on Kavachi. Yeah, you like that new logo? It looks pretty clean. But with the release of the new mystery box rework, of course, I've got to open up some boxes for you guys. But just like always guys, I've got a fucking huge giveaway for you guys. First comment on this video is going to win themselves a pet mystery box, which is valued at $25. And then I've got one mystery box, one super mystery box, two epic mystery boxes, and then 1,000 game credits, each going to five random commenters in the comment section below. This giveaway is over $150, so this is a big one, guys, especially on Kavachi. A lot of these items are worth a lot of money, and as you guys will see, you can get a lot of goodies from these boxes. Just like always, guys, all you have to do to enter is like the video, comment your in-game name on Kavachi, subscribe to my channel, and make sure to turn on post notifications because sometimes Sometimes I do choose the first commenter to win. Let's get into it. Before we jump into the box opening, I wanted to go over a few short quality of life updates that have been implemented into Kavachi. The main one being that the teleport manager now shows all of the possible drafts and rewards, which is pretty fucking sick. I was waiting for that to happen, but it does look really nice. And as you guys can see over here, pretty much every boss has a chance to drop mystery boxes. I believe it's 1 in 128 for the normal mystery boxes, 1 in 256 for the super, and then 1 in 512 for the epic mystery boxes, but I could be wrong on that one. And they have also added a skill of the day, which will automatically pick a random skill every 24 hours and give bonus XP anywhere from 5 to 10% for that skill so it is pretty cool and then just a few short bug fixes they fixed an issue with the achievements not showing correctly fixed a bug where your kill count would say zero sometimes you can no longer place your cannon inside the zeros god wars or the corp cave the barrel chest boss has had a little bit of a fix to it the next minions will now drop loot in front of them there is a few different quality of life updates on this thread and I will link it in the description down below but guys we've got a bunch of boxes to open so without wasting any more time let's jump into them and and here we are. So we have a hundred of each mystery box. I'm actually pretty curious on the loot myself because they have been reworked a little bit. I'm not sure if they now give double loots or what. I honestly have not opened up a single one of them. What the fuck is that? Oh, it's a broken Carol's Coif. I was like, I've literally never seen that item before. So of course, the normal mystery boxes are pretty much going to give junk for the most part. I guess the rare items are the barrels pieces, but they are the cheapest box coming in at about $2.50 for them. So don't expect too, too much from them. You can get a lot of them in game. So it is cool in that aspect. But we're going to spam through as much of these as we can. Okay, we just got four back-to-back -back granite pieces. What the fuck? One thing that I do love about Kavachi's mystery boxes is they give so many skilling supplies. And moving on to the next one, let's see what we get. Man, we are getting a lot of broken barrows. It actually triggers me that it is broken. Yeah, guys, I got some Darox plate legs. Ah, cool, I gotta go spend money to repair them. Feels fucking bad, man. 100 pure essence. 100 rune essence. It's not even pure essence. You actually get so many barrows pieces on these. Holy crap. So we've got 34 left. Let's spam through the remainder of these. Like I said, I wasn't really expecting too, too much from these. But it is nice to see the amount of barrows that come into the game through these. And that's those ones. And that's the regular mystery boxes. So that's those ones done. We did get quite a bit of loot. I want to say it's like 50-50 chance to get a Barrow's piece. Let's move on to the Super Mystery Boxes where we can actually get some fucking goodies. Hey, I love the skilling supplies, dude. Feels fucking good, man. Holy shit, I just got game- Yo, they added game credits to those. Sick. And two Mystery Boxes. Feel a fire cape. And actually repaired Barrow's. Feels good, man. Okay, this loot already is uh, looking a lot better. Got a couple sets of Rangers, got a fire cape, and some Mystery Boxes. Oh! Yo, <laughs> Uh, <laughs> alrighty. <laughs> There's a red party hat. That was like my 13th super. Uh, there's a couple more mystery boxes in there. And an armadillo helmet. Jesus Christ, dude. Ooh, an abyssal whip. Why is that a yell? That's annoying. It's a blessed spirit shield. Calm down. And spamming through the remainder of these. Let's see what we get. Come on, pop off another party hat. I do believe... Oh, I was literally about to say I do believe you can get third age. <laughs> That's fucking awesome, dude. Armadillo chain skirt. Come on, dude. Give me the... Give me the Armadillo chest plate. An archer's ring? That's eh, okay, I guess. Starting out, I'd probably rather like a fury or something over an archer's ring. And there we go for that inventory. So I do know a lot of this loot is going into my bank elsewhere. For example, the party hat. Apparently, I already have a third age amulet. Another third age amulet. Come on, dude. And some tacits. Oh, another double mystery box. Yo, what is up with this blessed spirit shield shit? That should not be a yell. I feel like that is completely useless. Oh, we got some more game credits. What the fuck? What? All right. Uh, uh, all right. We got two third age amulets and two red party hats. Hey, what do you mean, dude? It's my third third age amulet from these. Why is it got to be the amulet? Give me something I actually want. Come on, four left. Oh, we got the yellow party hat. Once again, though, I think I already have one. Yeah, I've literally... Wow, dude. Come on, I want a different color. Either way, that's still pretty fucking sick. Moving on to the epic mystery boxes. These are the big boy items. They're actually worth a decent amount. So uh, let's see how lucky we get. Fucking fifth one in we get a purple party hat come on dude bam through yo fucking 600 rune bars holy crap 
That's a lot of XP right there. Oh, another blessed spirit shield. A fucking doo-doo item, dude. And another inventory. Let's go, dude. 800 game credits. That's fucking good. And a BCP. Over 250 frost dragon bones. Jesus. Yo, fuck off with the third age amulets, dude. I have so many. I get the third age item, but fuck. I don't want said third age item. There's that inventory done. Got ourselves a BCP and the third age amulet off that one. Come on, dude. Give me another party hat. Or an actual third age item that's wearable. Come on. Ooh, we got the tacits again. Third age or party hat. Third age or party hat. Calling it in one box. And now. Fuck. I got excited. I saw the B ring. Hey, we got the yellow, but we already have two. Either way, it's still a party hat. You can pretty much never complain if you get a party hat. It's always so satisfying seeing a party hat. So we got five left here. Come on. One more rare. Please. Ah, the Armadillo Hilt. Easy. Gotta make that AGS somehow. So that is the epic boxes done. I have three of each fucking red and yellow party hat, and I have one purple. Unlucky. So we do have the pet mystery boxes left. I'm not sure how many pets are actually in game. Oh, we just got the Kingback Dragonling. Commander Miniana. Howcalf. Wait, let me see that. <laughs> Yo, that's sick. <laughs> oh, the next Terminator. Pog Champ. What the fuck is a sappy? All right, I'm just gonna spam through these, pretty much unlock every one of the pets, and uh, go over the pets afterwards. I love the names of some of these pets. All right, I have every pet already. So let's go through these. Let's see Chaos Ellie. Hello, Ellie. Oh, that particle effect is sick on her. All right, moving on. Let's uh, summon Chikara. Dude, I love pets, honestly. I turn RuneScape into Pokemon. Just got to collect everything. Zilliana. Actually, my favorite pet. Actually, my favorite pet, because I believe Zilliana was one of my first pets that I got on RuneScape 3. And we got the Corporal Puppy. Like, 3k kill count on RuneScape. Don't have it. Still a clean-looking pet. Yo, is that... Yo, the next Terminator is so big. Let me see this. And then, of course, we got the Cow Calf. Actually, a Pogchamp pet. Explodey. Okay. Explodey being one of the Glacors. That's it. General Audor. I love the names that RuneScape came up with. Krill Tiny Roth. Feels good, man. I got that pet at like 300 kill count on RuneScape. What else do we got? King Black Dragonling. I wish it was the updated version, but it still does look clean. Uh, what else? What else? We got the Mini Worm. I think that's Wildy Worm, isn't it? It is. Oh, and it's got a trail effect. Yo, look at that. That's clean. And then, of course, the next Terminator. Next is like as big as you. That's cool. And then, of course, to end it off, we got the TD Pet. Teddy Demon, how you doing, dude? Well, guys, that is gonna wrap up the video. We actually did get extremely lucky on that box opening, and some of these pets are fucking clean, as you guys just saw. Just like always, guys, don't forget to enter that juicy giveaway. Smash like if you enjoyed, and until next one, guys, I hope you did enjoy.